All right, so we're back. This is a third series of videos. We're going to show you how somebody gets poked with a needle here. We got the master specialist here, uh, uh, Prisco, doing it. And Prisco does a lot of things. He does filming. He does a lot of things. Now he's now he's poking with this. Uh, well, not very big needle, but he's poking with the needle, and he always gets it first time. Uh, you know, you have to be a natural to do this, and uh, he's a real natural doing this, aren't you, Prisco? Take your head to, uh, yes, I'm a natural, no, yes, no, yes, yes, you are. <clears throat> okay, so you see it's in now, relatively painless. The undisclosed patient that we've got here is uh, not saying a word, so you can tell that that wasn't very uh, painful, or else he'd be screaming. So you know that this is not a painful procedure. Now what Prisco's doing is flushing the line just to make sure that uh, the line is clear and that it's okay and that he can start the IV. And what we're going to do is we're going to talk about the IV a bit because it's another one of those things that we do. The IV is called clear wood, uh, just as I said it, clear and wood. And we'll ask Prisco what clear wood actually does. Okay, clear wood actually um, kill uh, the virus in our body, for example, um, herpes virus and so on but it's actually good for herpes. So it's a viral killer, that's what it is, right? Yes. And Clearwood is a con concoction of our own. And uh, you know, don't start searching for it on the internet because you're not going to find it. It's one of our own things. And what it does is it takes out the virus. Now correct me if I'm wrong, okay? Let's go. Yeah. It takes out the virus out of every part of the body so that uh, we can sort of make it drunk so that uh, we can hit it with ozone, right? Yes. And this is, this is what basically it does, right? Okay, so there you go. We're gonna use Clearwood on this patient today. There it is, you can see it. You've seen all this other stuff. Until next time, adios amigos.